Yeah. yeah. We're here looking at the front of Chatter after the Shredderator fight. You can see all the cars out that Shredderator made. A lot bigger than the ones Malice is making. They've got a lot more mass behind their disc. You can see they hit the tie here. First person to hit the tie through the new armor. Looks like we're going to need to switch out to a new side piece here. We got some shear bolts on this side so our titanium wedge behind the UHMW is completely pulled off. Billet still in one piece unscathed. Batteries Billet are cool. is Motors indestructible. Are cool. Wheels are in one piece. Hammers in one piece still attached. <laughs> There's a first for everything. Hey, the backstop <laughs> even looks good. We can reuse one finally. Yeah. I mean, Shredderator looked in top form there. You know, they, they spun up, they held it, they spun up, they held it. Um, I don't think they're used to hitting the plastic. It hits differently. It affects the controllers differently. Take a look at Shredderator. Paul, do you want to talk about some of these hits and how we knew where to hit? Yeah, so they've got these Lexan panels. Uh, don't touch it, but yeah. On top of their uh, spinning ring here. So we tried to punch a hole in all of them. We made it through two. Uh, we hit these three. You can see the pretty deep gouges. It, I mean, this is bulletproof plastic, so the fact that we're able to shatter them is pretty impressive. Um, under here, and I want to get them out here to rotate this, something in here is pretty badly dented. So I think whatever, you know, strike punched a hole in that panel hit something pretty important underneath it. You can also it. see some pretty big dents here, and this hit the LEDs, whatever's under them. SC and Shatter are brought to you by Prismere, TMS Titanium, and Maxamp Batteries, and viewers like you.